My dad's not super happy about it. Uh, my grandma isn't very happy about it at all. My family wasn't that yeah, gun ho for it. My mom wasn't actually horrible about it. Well, she's very traditional, so she's afraid. That but he says he'll still love me. Um, it's it's taken quite a bit to get around to her. They weren't too happy about it when she came around. Hopefully, when she sees that it's not actually that weird after all, maybe she'll come around. My mom is a breast cancer survivor along with her cousin and a lot of family members and, and their close friends. My aunt actually had breast cancer. She's been two years in remission now, so she's pretty much the one that like um, gave me the bump to actually do it. I was watching Hulu and this ad for St. Baldur's came on and I got interested and then I, I clicked on it and I read about it. And like you can shave your head and the proceeds go to help children's cancer research and it's like, that's amazing, right? I've never actually known anybody with childhood cancer, which I'm just really thankful because that would be just heartbreaking and I want to help out even though I haven't been directly affected by it, I can't imagine what they're going through and what their families are going through. I went around to all my neighbors and then talked about it in my classes, so I've pretty much annoyed everybody in my life already for donations and for accepting them two weeks afterwards. Well, we ask that you get them to us two weeks afterwards, but you can still donate straight to the cause and you don't have to donate directly to our event. So um, if you go to stbaldricks.org, then you can donate straight to them. It goes to um, either to help the children with cancer or to um, like promising research projects, you know, to help fund the cure for cancer is just kind of the big hope. When you're an adult, you can kind of understand what you're going through better, but a lot of kids, it's like no one really looks like I do now and it's harder for them to understand what's really going on. So it's just kind of a way to say, you know, it doesn't have to be weird that you're bald. These people are doing it just to raise money to help you out. So I think it's a really cool class. <laughs>